A military veteran died Monday after waiting for an ambulance to take him just 500 yards to the emergency room. Turns out the problem was he was already at the Albuquerque VA hospital. KOAT Action 7 News reporter Kristen Swanson is there live now to explain how this happened. Doug and Shelley, witnesses say a man collapsed in the cafeteria here at the VA hospital. So staff did what they were supposed to and followed policy. They called 911 and waited for an ambulance to come and drive him around the building to the ER. Imagine you're at a hospital eating lunch and you collapse. Instead of doctors rushing to your aid, you wait 30 minutes for an ambulance to drive you around the building to the emergency room. That scenario became reality for one veteran Monday. According to officials at the VA, a patient collapsed in the cafeteria Monday. Witnesses say he looked like he was having a heart attack. So staff in the cafeteria followed the rules in place. VA policy states that if any medical emergency happens outside of the main hospital, staff calls 911. The Albuquerque Fire Department told Action 7 News that an ambulance did dispatch a crew Monday at 12.30 p.m. to the VA hospital's address. EMTs arrived on scene and loaded the veteran in the ambulance. They drove him on the VA complex from one building to another. This map shows where the cafeteria is located on the Albuquerque VA property. It also shows the pathway around the exterior of the main hospital to the emergency room entrance. It takes four minutes to walk that green line on the map. By the time the ambulance got to the cafeteria, loaded up the veteran and drove him around the building, it was too late. He died.